Wow, it has been a little while. I just don't upload that much, because guess what? If it's not Rec Room, it's not going to get me views. So, I'm not making a Rec Room video. I'm going to not make them anymore, okay? So, for all my nine-year-old fans out there, shut up. Anyways, so now we're talking about Resident Evil 4, because I literally played the game three times already. I think I know what I'm talking about. I've gone through every nook and cranny of the game. It's cool. So, Resident Evil 4 adapted, like, great to VR. Like, this game is phenomenal in it. I don't see... I can see Oculus, like, making more games. I think the next one I'm going to report is 6, or heck, even 8. That's not going to happen. It's just not going to happen. And Resident Evil 4, that was my first Resident Evil game I played. So, really, this is my first time going into the franchise, I knew it existed before. Heck, I even watched the <laughs> quote-unquote anime series on Netflix. Um, and to be honest, Resident Evil 4 was a great way to go in. I just loved it. Leon Kennedy, great. He's a Chad. He's literally a freaking Chad. He is so cool. He gets the girls. Yeah, what a Chad. <laughs> he's buff. Yes, very buff. He knows he's got good reflex. He knows how to defeat people. Just Leon is a Chad. And Resident Evil 4... Actually, I thought when I first bought the game, it took forever to download. And then I realized... Yeah, if, it, if it's going to take forever to download, it might crash on me. No, it didn't. It ran very smoothly, actually. And um, it's very impressive. It, it is impressive. How can you port, like... Uh, when did it come out? Like, 2006? I don't know. How could you port, like, a 2006 game? Actually, I could see it, but... To a standalone device? Like, the only thing that made me mad was Oculus being little greedy rats. And they went, okay. So, luckily I had a Quest 2 just lying around. And Resident Evil 4. Um, I'm really just gonna be talking about the game in general, like... It is cool that you can hold a knife and the gun at the same time. You couldn't do that in the original game, which... That's pretty cool. You move a little faster. That's an advantage. Um, calling out all speedrunners out there. I think this is a game for you. And um, I think the exploration just went, like... It made my smooth brain go sicko mode for a second. Because, like... Dang, bro. I, I just like looking for stuff. It's It's cool. It's pretty nice, it's enjoyable, it's cool. But, the one thing I didn't like about the game... So, the merchant. Alright, we're gonna talk about the merchant for a second. The merchant is my man. I wanna marry the merchant. He is literally a god. Bro, he's so cool, dude. He helps me out like a freaking... I ask for, hey, can I get a gun? He goes, you know, t take seven. No, my bad, my bad. Take eight. And I'm like, ah, oh, thanks, man. But if you don't have enough uh, money, what's the merchant going to do? Literally nothing. Li I don't need to go out in public to just see if I have money, I'm going to get stabbed. So if you don't have money, this man, this man, no sweat, just puts it back. He's like, all right, go on your way. Literally epic. The merchant, best character of the whole game. Ashley, I hate Ashley. She is annoying. I literally wanted to make Leon look cool. I'm like, ah, sweet. There's a new outfit for Leon. It makes him look epic. And then, Ashley. Oh, my God, bro. Ah. No. So, the game was weird. It's vi this is my This is my ranking. I give it... I give it, like, a... 8 out of 10. It's a good game. Oh, duh, it's a good game, but... If you have motion sickness and you get, like, disturbed or, heck, even gross easily, probably something you might want to wait out on, because while playing the game, yeah, it, it, it gets nasty, but... Goes up to my ranking on the Quest 2 titles. I think it goes third under Saints and Sinners. So, yeah, pretty good game. Since and Sinners is a little bit doesn't work as well, so good game. That's all I have to say. I'm Go Fish. Adios.